Alright, and welcome back to my playthrough of Wii Party U for the Wii U. Should still be obvious what we're playing at this point, but anyways, we are on to the back half of Fashion Plaza. See, there's a reason I split it, split it in half, because that was the longest one yet out of this project. So, yeah, Fashion Plaza is long. And like I said, I think what I'm going to do is I'm going to triple roll and hopefully get the hell out of here. Maybe this will be the perfect get me the hell out. This may be the most trips I've ever gotten to make to the uh, center stage. And perfect, another roll. I'd rather, there is a quad roll. There is a quad roll. I would love, is this the outfit you want? Hell yeah. Hell, hell to the no. To the no, no, no. No, this is actually the outfit I want. And if I can get a gladiator helmet now, I can get a full set of that for even more. Could be the best score I'll ever put together. I think the best score I've put together so far in this game is like 51. So, and I got a specialty roll and a costume piece and... Really? It stopped it on the... Although, I'll take the slow-mo roll. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna get rid of that. I gotta remember the timing on the slow-mo roll, because it's not Mario Party style. It's definitely a little more... a little more iffy. Wow, and she... oh my god, she's had that whole pirate setup for a long time now. Too bad a versus space isn't in my future, I'd fucking take it from her. Okay, so you do just press it on there. That makes sense. Although, what do you... Why are you going for the caveman outfit? You don't have a full... Oh, you do have a full set. Jeez, how many... Oh, it's only... The caveman outfit's pretty cheap, though. He's only gonna get 10 points. So, no point in that. But I think what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go for that I'm gonna go for that mini game to try and get the piece that I want. And okay, I'm good being on the back half on uh, the half I'm on because the controls suck on the gamepad. I've tried it; it's not easy. Tube toss. -up. The gamepad player throws tubes to try and trap the rival players. If all the rival players get trapped by tubes, the gamepad player wins. Yeah, they flick the tubes. By the way, they actually have to securely hit us. They can bounce off us. That's what makes this hard. At least for the single player. Although, I'm in a, I'm in a very crap spot. Kind of wish I was on the edge, but... Nope. Oh, I have to tilt the son of a... Well, I guess they couldn't make the controls too easy. Damn it. Okay, I should probably stay... Just stay the hell away from them. Shit. No! Come on, man. Go, man, go. Yeah, I, we're just gonna stay over here. I'm just gonna stay over here and... <sighs> Come on, man, you could do it. You could do it, you're a bro. <laughs> okay, I didn't think... I've never seen that happen, that's great. Hey, we still won, so... But that's... <laughs> I've never seen someone get double-tubed. I didn't know you could! And what's the point? You don't win! You don't win anything except my laughter, which means nothing. Okay, so yeah, I want the... I need the gladiator hood. That means I need a five. Oh, wait. Yeah, why do the, why do the minigame when I can just get a five and just... What? Why not just do the mini game that I, just get the piece that I want and get out of dodge? What? Why? Why overcomplicate this? You're overcomplicating this, Luca. Cool. That means. Wow. That means I can actually get around again, and the Roman outfit's still worth a pretty good, pretty penny. Wow. She finally made it. She, although she is gonna pull ahead of them because she does have the best costume. Yeah, because that is worth a lot of... Po Although, pirate, huh. 
and Ro so I guess the costumes do sort of change every time you play. That's that's actually interesting. I mean, the Mario one is still always here, and I think the Jurassic one is too, but I don't know if they swap the pirate and the... Well, I know it's a cowboy instead of a pirate. I know that much. <clears throat> that's all I know. I don't know much, but that's all I know. That's my story, and I'm sticking to it. There's a reason I never went into music, because I can't sing worth shit. I'm not ashamed to admit it. I See, that's the other thing, is Fashion Plaza is so long, it's already frayed me of everything that... I have nothing to talk. Eh. A one, two, or three roll could be good, depending on... When the world make a little laugh, clown, laugh. Yeah, the clown piece would definitely be worth two spots. The bigger pieces like that, the Mario costume and the caveman thing, are all worth two spots in your in your costume closet. Not worth it. Me, I'm gonna get the hell out of here. If I can roll, if I can roll a decent number. Thank you. That'll be perfect for next time. And I guess I have this to fall back on if I ever... I don't need it. It's a goddamn... It's like one of the lower end items, because at least the Mario one is middle of the road tier costume. The clown ones... If we're grading these, Mario is C and the clown's a fucking D. Actually, I did notice that six... No. Oh, the caveman's only worth five. Wow, that's... That is cheap. That's worth five, then the clown is worth seven, then Mario is eight, then the gladiator the gladiator is worth nine, and the pirate's worth ten. Okay. Wow, but man, that's how bad the caveman one is. Do not and I built towards that too, because that's just what happened. But man, that thing is worth crap. Uh time for a min time for a minigame? No, not yet. Maybe at the end of this turn. Uh, where am I on the map? I am still ways out, but I got that triple dice. So let's hope I can get a good number and get out of here. Eh, could be worse. That'll at least get me another specialty roll and get me the hell out of here. Nope, it will not. And pirate boots are not... <sighs> yeah, I'm so not... I am so not taking that clown outfit. It's not worth anything. Like, it ain't worth shit. That means I'm actually pretty close to the finish line. D I've used up all my specialty dice, haven't I? Wow, yeah, you have a... Oh, but things could happen. Including a time... Is this the only place you can get a times four bonus? Ugh. He got the golden dice. Th he got the golden ticket. I mean, I'm not really worried because he doesn't... He has no points, really. I'm trying to think about where he stands in the hierarchy. I will find out. If okay, fashion minigame. Oh, you get to steal the costume here. I was hoping for the knitting one just because I like it. I'm okay with this, though. Assemble! Go bots, assemble! Put together legs, torso, and heads to assemble as many robots as you can. Earn one point for a multicolored bot, three points for a single, and five for a golden one. We're factory workers. We assemble toys for the kids. If you have a matching toy, you get the points. Start. And having the patience to match it is a little... Nope, this is mine. I know having, you know, having the patience to match things is definitely not... Damn it! I wish I'd known that gold one was going by. I would have gone for. I would have gone for it, but oh well. 
and may as well get a mismatched one at the end. Like it matters, I think I got, yeah, I got two matching ones and a golden one. I'm good. Oh, I'm good. Bang. See? No need to, and plus I assembled more bots than them anyways. No need to rush. What's the point? Because putting together, because they each only put together two robots each and they were all crap. At least mine matched. So... So it's a game that I like. I would've... I, I don't see, like, the knitting one enough. I think I've only done that one twice since playing this game. Okay, so what do I need? I need... I'm not gonna mess up your outfit, but I will take... Yeah, I will take the pirate top. perfect I think we I think we just stole from the person who can't who yeah third and fourth can't steal anything so that's even bigger salt wounds but wow we are on the final stretch and oh if I get a six I can man a lot of numbers are good here I mean as long as I can get to the finish line that actually could be good a times three, that's fine. I can use this to steal more pirate garb. Yeah, because I need the... What comes first? That means I need the pirate... Does anybody have pirate... Nobody has pirate pants. Oh, no, you... Are those pirate pants? Yes, they are. Okay, I need pirate pants. Give me a good mini game. That's all I ask. I'm okay with this. Alley hoops. Each player tries to get as many balls in the basket as possible. Remember, you're all trying to shoot at the same time. Get the gold ball in the net for three points. So, oh yeah, flick up and flick down. Been a while since I played this one, so... Yeah, so... Oh, and it's just one-on-one, -on -one, meaning I'll be... As long as I'm, you know, good about when... Damn it, tried to stop her. Oh well, doing doing this game one on one's not hard because because you don't have to worry about other players interfering. When it's when it's everybody, then the timing is a little bit more important. Because you could you could get fucked up by a lot of people. Whew, that's actually, I, I'll admit, I like Alley Hoops, because you actually, it's one of the games that we mo we motion controls aren't terrible at, and I am going to get rid of this crap. Oh my god, I am on my way to possibly making bank on points. I am well on my way. I'm on my way. I'm well on my way. And is she going to... She's going to get the one-stop shop, isn't she? Damn you. Damn you. Me, I just want to... I just want to go uh, cash this out, because then I can... Then I can get one more. I'll have the most trips I've ever gotten to center stage. Mainly because everything is playing in my favor. That's why I like this one, because it's... This one is a little bit more skillful than... Oh. Fuck you. Huh, one-on-one -on -one and no golds, no golds barred. Neat. Kick any of your colors, kick your colors soccer balls into the, any of the four goals as fast as you can, but try not to kick any of your opponent's soccer balls into the goal. Okay, so, and it's just one-on-one, -on -one, meaning this will go really good, and I'm blue, so that means get blue. I think this is my last... No! Finish. Get out of here. <laughs> and he... Oh, he had a few left on the field, but man, that game is definitely different than... A lot of these games feel different one-on-one -on -one than they do in group setting, but I'll admit, I kind of like that touch of having the same game for both, because then it really makes it a different feel. 
because they made the mini games to where you can do it and it really you know it definitely makes it a different feel which I I'll admit like I said I like but yeah I think this turn I just want to make it back to center stage and then that means I need a good roll to get me out of here shit okay well I'm risking it but that's fine Perfect, I made it back to center stage. This is what I want to take. I've already won this. I've already absolutely crushed the competition. And you'll you'll see, I'll be able to get more points after this. You'll see why. I'm not going to explain. I've played Fashion Plaza enough to know these things by now, though. And I get a costume piece, and that means I want a... Do I want the pirate hat? Wow! I didn't- I certainly didn't want that. But yeah, I'm de I've definitely won. You don't realize I've already won. And... I, I hate her for being able to do that. I think that's all she's assembled is full pirate garb. Holy crap, that's actually... Only two- she's played smart. See, play smarter, not harder. But she's still not going to catch up. She can't. It's impossible. There's only one turn left, and I'm and I'm using the big times three roll that I got. Why? Because I can. Maybe maybe if I'm lucky, I'll get the uh, I'll get the missing piece of the pirate garb and can get one more times two. Even if I don't, this will be the best score I've ever gotten. Oh dear. Why would you- what, what? Assembling literally, literally anything else, even mismatched, is better. Yeah, so I need the pirate hood, which- Oh man, of course it's right there. Damn it. You know what? I'm just gonna go for broke. I don't care. I don't care. Let's see what happens. I'm not even gonna try and count those on the board, so let's let's see what happens. That actually worked out beautifully. Okay, so I need... I need to steal this away from you. I'm sorry, I'm gonna need this. I'm gonna need to borrow this. Oh, fuck me. Okay. Ice spinner, spin around and strike a pose. Get two points for each spin and for ending in a pose. 20 points for facing forward, 10 for backwards, and one, oh no, 10 for horizontally, and one for backwards. So spin, spin, spin. I hate this game. I should probably strap doesn't function perfectly on this controller, but I will take it. Oh, no, wait, it's because I'm doing... Eh, fuck it. Three, two, one, go! Damn it! Wait, I am so confused. Oh, she missed the pose! Oh, thank God! That means, wow, I could potentially get a another score at the end with another complete set. Holy, holy balls. Holy, holy sidekicks, Batman. And thank you, and I screwed her out of her complete set. Because for all intents and purposes, I should have lost. I should have fucking lost. Yeah, screw you, no pirate getup for you. And she's only going to get... She's still going to... Funny enough, she'll still get 10 points, but no doubles. Too bad. Wow, that means I could potentially... If things go well, I can get into the 70s. That is the most I've had by a fucking country mile. 
Well, we got... We gotta still wait for him, and I think two more people have to go? Where are you on the map? That's fine. I don't even give a shit what you do. I really don't. And I don't care what she did, because that was stupid. And, yeah, good, you don't deserve points anyways for being stupid and buying the full kit. Why would you go for the lowest thing? Why would you go... But yeah, we have one more challenge. It's time for a, a minigame. The player who finishes in first place will have to hit the center stage for a fashion evaluation. You're in last place, so... Yep, he gets to pick. I'm okay with that, I actually... I would have preferred the bike one, because it's more challenging and it's... Okay, so... One of the birds in the flock has eyebrows. Find that heavy brad bird among the other feathered fellows along the rocky wall and quickly snap a picture. Okay, so zoom in with one, and when the finder turns red, hold down on one and press two to take a photo. And we have to look for a bird with fucking eyebrows. It's actually easier than it sounds. And golden birds! Oh, this is gonna be great. What are we, what are we looking for? Find the one with the eyebrows. Right. Yep, found it. Why does it even matter what everybody else does? Because it, it's only first. Finish. It's only first that gets to, you know, go on center stage, so. But yeah, for some reason, the damn bird has eyebrows. Don't ask me. I don't know how bird anatomy works. He could be the misfit freak of nature. Who knows? But hold the Wiimote vertically. Do you want... Is this the costume you want to take? Why, yes it is! This actually went a lot better than I could have hoped for. Because I've never gotten to pose four times, much less with full, complete sets of a lot of good shit. Bam! And you are a pirate. Double points! Ungar. Thank you. Bam! Absolutely destroyed it! Good job, everyone. Now for the final results of the game. The winner got a total of 74 points. La la. I am a pirate. Ironically, I did dress as a pirate for one Halloween. So, Lucera is the winner. Congratulations. Yep, and I am on top top of the world I think I'm the yeah she's the only one, other one who got to go twice they only got to pose once and it did not end well for either of them she got to go to the second stage after I fucked her over out of her points and then me 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 man that that went well that went well Trying to debate on what I want to do, though. You know what I think I'm going to do is... I think I'm going to bring this project to an official close. It's a shame that you can only do so little on here, especially if you're by yourself. You m lose about 60% of the game. Don't get me wrong, the other 40% is fun. It's just a shame that you lose the other 60 and how would I even record the other... Ga I'd have to have a big, impressive setup to be able to do <clears throat> to do the other games, and I don't. But I think what I'm going to do is officially end this project here. I enjoyed playing it as much as you miss out on. Because you'll... Actually, 60%? She could probably lose more than that. <clears throat> but no, the games you get to play are fun. They're actually enjoyable. It's... Another spin at a Mario Party game, which doesn't outright fail like Sonic Shuffle did. It's it's middle of the road. It's better than a lot of the newer Mario Party games, but still doesn't hold a candle to the classics. But it's it's a fun little board game spin that Nintendo did to try and get away from that, and I enjoyed playing it. And yeah, like I said, a bonus video will be coming of probably just the tabletop games, and that's about it. That's probably all I'm going to do there with a the bonus video. But no, this project is officially going to be brought to a close here. So I hope you enjoyed watching. I certainly had fun playing. And until the next one, as always, 
Thanks for watching.